Movies, animation, and video games aren't actually moving. What you see on screen is really a series of images being shown one after another. When this happens really quickly, we stop seeing the individual images and start perceiving motion. Frame rate refers to the number of images shown every second. So for example, a frame rate of 24 frames per second or 24 FPS means that every second of animation will contain 24 images, also known as frames. Commonly used frame rates include 24, 25, 30 or 60 FPS, with the general idea being that the higher the frame rate, the smoother the animation or video will look. 24 frames per second is widely accepted as the industry standard frame rate for cinema and has been since the 1930s, back when you know movies were still being recorded on rolls of film. And now, a hundred years later, we're so used to watching movies at 24 FPS that we subconsciously associate it with the cinematic look. So even though we can now record movies and videos digitally at much higher frame rates and practically for free, many movies and TV shows still stick to 24 FPS. Besides the cinematic association, animation has a few more reasons to use the 24 FPS standard. Unlike videos or live action movies where you can just point a camera at something and hit record, every single frame of an animation has to be created. What this means is that higher frame rates require more work for every second of animation. While the 60fps animation will probably look more fluid, the truth is that most people watching won't really notice the difference. Before getting caught up in the technical details of our animation, it's worth keeping in mind that the purpose of animation, most animation at least, is to tell stories. Now, 24 drawings per second of animation sounds like a lot, and it really is. In the real world, animators don't always create a new drawing for every single frame of animation. Sometimes we show a single drawing for two frames or three or even more. Holding a drawing for two frames is known as animating on twos. Holding a drawing for three frames is known as animating on threes and so on. This obviously greatly reduces the number of drawings that need to be created, but it's not all about saving time and money. Using a combination of ones, twos, and threes will let you create smooth animation that feels nice and energetic without wasting time and energy adding drawings where it's not needed. To recap, we've learned in this video that animation is an illusion created by showing a series of images quickly. Frame rate is the number of images or frames shown every second, with 24 FPS being the most commonly used frame rate. Animators can choose to animate on twos or on threes to save time or to achieve a specific look. Anyways, thank you for watching. Let me know in the comments if you guys still have any questions. Stick around for more animation-related videos and see you next time. Bye!